Hi class, I'm Lisa Stewart from Idaho Falls, Idaho, and I'm here to do my second career profile. So, um, the profile of the career that I worked on this time around um, was for a school psychologist. Um, the job position that I looked at is actually an open job position um, nearby where I grew up um, at the Idaho Falls um, School District. Um, and so it's just the school di district right next to the one that um, I grew up in. Um, the contact information that I found um, was for Carrie Smith. It gave um, an address and phone number so I can contact her um, if I were to actually be interested in the position at this time. Um, it's fairly, I mean, it's a school, so it's fairly small and um, fairly regular hours. Minus where it is for school, it, the summers would be off, um, but um, fairly flexible with your needs and uh, definitely family friendly. Um, being at school the same time your children would be at school. Um, once again, the typical stressors for this job would be um, the fact that you do see a lot of sad things going on um, in this in this job position. Um, seeing young people go through things that they shouldn't have to go through at this age, so that would be difficult to see. Um, the benefits, uh, what it said on their website um, for this job position is it said the benefits would be in accordance um, with approved board policy and salary would be in accordance with the placement um, on the teacher salary schedule um, depending on your education um, and experience. So. Uh, it didn't give really specifics on it, but um, fairly similar things to um, other jobs in, in teaching areas. Um, uh, common job tasks would be to um, communicate with students, parents, staff members, um, looking at the issues and um, trying to find accurate information. Uh, also, you know, making sure that we, or that I maintain um, high ethical behavior and confidentiality for the students, um, as I would be their counselor. Um, educational requirements, you know, uh, it said that it would prefer um, like bachelor's and master's in this, but it, would be, it requires um, a national certificate. Um, for the school, for the National School Psychology Certification Board. So um, those things would be looked for as well. Um, the pay, so the salary range, kind of as I mentioned before, is kind of dependent. Um, however, it is anywhere from 40 to 70, depending on um, your experience. So. Um, just kind of other information is it just kind of says that um, the position at the school where it is at a school um, they would kind of use you for whatever they needed so um, you obviously have your main position but if they needed you to do other things um, it would be determined by the needs of the district and um, budgetary constraints and then in addition to that the position would be evaluated so um, every year by so yeah, so it would be <laughs> evaluated every year by um, an assistant superintendent. Um, and then I just found my information on their school websites and a job posting board. And I think that's about it. So have a good day and have fun with the conference.